I knew I'd get some thumbs down immediately on that video. I knew it would happen. Anything that attacks this side of things uh, gets a lot of people pissed off. You get your panties in a bind. And, you know, that kind of culture, it, it, you know, it, you can say, oh, well, it's, it's just kids. Yeah, and why are kids having that kind of attitude? Do you know what it is? And it, it, it has to do with unrealistic standards put on to boys and put on to men as to what they're supposed to be in order to be boys or men. It's unrealistic standards. People having to come to those standards and then laughing about uh, the things that are involved in trying to come to those standards. It's this phrase that many of you don't like to hear because when you hear it, you think that it's attacking anything that's masculine at all, but it's not. And that is the phrase toxic masculinity. Okay, and I know people don't want to hear that phrase ever. But that's some of the kind of thing that the phrase is referring to. And it's people feeling they have to come to those standards. That's part of why we have a high suicide rate amongst guys. It's, it's part of that. You have to come to this standard or you're not a real man. Or you're just a wuss or you're just a pussy or you're just a faggot or you're just a etc etc etc. Oh, but they're just kids. Yes, and what do kids grow up to be? They grow up to be adults. Okay? When they're kids is one of the points in which it's the most important to address some of this stuff. That's the point where they're learning these standards that they feel they have to come to. That's when it's pushed onto them the most. Is when, excuse me, is when they're kids. What part of that don't you understand? 